Do you know why we want to use your father, Harmony? Mauled was around during the original Delta incident in Hoenn. Yo, what up everyone, it's TranTriTube and welcome back to Pokemon Insurgents. In the last episode, guys, we took on the gym leader of the city. It was Harmony, which is actually someone we met way earlier in the game when we had to deal with the Perfection Cult, when Kiram and Reshiram were all in the same place. It's so crazy how many things are going on in this game. But pretty much what happened is, this: there's a hospital up here. And the last time we went into it before we took on the gym, the power was all gone. Let me actually go to it while I'm talking. And dude, the granny is gone! There was a granny here who said she cleaned all this crap up, and she did it! Now I can't go in there! Okay, well, let's freaking go in here. Is Dr. Fuji still here? Thank God, man. As long as freaking Dr. Fuji's here. Look at this place, dude. So there's no electricity. We saw this earlier in the last episode. Pretty much what happened is someone sabotaged the hospital and got the electricity cut. And it would probably... Old man, you got up? Hello? Oh, no, you're always up, old man. But yeah, look in here. People are sleeping. They need their power for when they wake up. I think it would make a lot of sense if this was done by the Dark Ride call because they feed on people's memories. And in the beginning of the game, they try to take our memories, but then we got saved by Miu. So there's two doors here. Hey, kid, it's me, the director. Listen, you are a hit. People love you on TV. Would you mind coming back to the broadcast tower? We need to start filming the next episode right away. What is he? Who called me on the phone? Dude, you know who that probably was? That's probably way in the beginning of the series when we filmed this show with some people and they took us to the desert and that's where we found our Delta freaking muck. Dude, that takes me back. I guess we're gonna have to do that in another episode, but let's explore this hospital for now. So let's go up here. There's a couple more rooms here. It's kind of rude how you can just... Can I... I'm gonna get sick if I stay in that. It's kind of... Did my eyes go to... My eyes closed? No, they didn't close. That that freaking got me for a sec. All right. So you can just rob everyone's uh, possessions. Just like she's listening to music. It's TM Dragon Pulse. Granny, this is not good for you. A trainer? I remember those days well. I'll have you know, I was one of the best. Why don't you help yourself to the... I robbed it already. Are you a freaking... Are you Drasna? Are you Claire? Claire, you're 50 years older. This game does take place 50 years later, which is pretty cool. All right. Oh, Granny! Granny, wake up! <laughs> it's a man. I'm sorry. I didn't assume the gender. What if you found a Pokeball and there's like a Pokemon in it? I think that's one of the things in Ultra Sun and Moon. There's like a Pokeball and the trainer didn't return to it. Um, I'm going to have this bug spray because there's some people, bad people nearby. I used to live in Agate Village in the Ore region. It was a beautiful place, but not nearly as quiet as Sonata City, which is quite ironic given its name. Dude, or is the region that Pokemon Coliseum takes place in? You're mixing up even that game into the continuity of this? That's pretty crazy. Old man, Dark Rise coming for you. Dream well, sleep well. Let me take your burn heal. I love you too! Great ball. Alright, so that's it for this floor. Let's go back downstairs. It's just these five rooms now. Hey, you're up. I was just dismissed from the hospital yesterday, so I'm packing my things up. Hope I didn't leave anything behind. Why did your dialogue go from red to blue? Multiple personalities? Also, you're kind of lucky because this hospital might be under attack. I'm gonna need this escape rope. I don't know who left it there. Most people hospitalized don't stay here too long. We use the healing abilities of Pokemon to speed up their recovery. Oh, you're a nurse. You look like an aroma lady. Maybe an aromatherapy lady. Alright, this is the last room right here. We got the Ultra Ball. I guess... Oh, we gotta go into the basement. Dude, of course! Yo, what y'all saying here? It's the perfection call? Yo, my theory went down the... Of course! The last time we dealt with Kiram, it was with Harmony here. Of course, they would be the ones clashing heads again. You again, from the Sun Touch City gym, right? Pleased to see you again, Harmony. You too, Damo, Nora... My name is Tyen, the dude who slaughtered my team. If you don't remember, I'm part of perfection. Don't worry, I didn't forget. Didn't you, uh, slap a child and try to kidnap Reshiram? Freaking slap a child. You, at the back, I don't know why you're tampering with our power, but you better start explaining. Don't worry, Harmony, we'll turn the power back on. We just want to talk to you, that's all. 
They baited us. Rukra, what? What are you doing? Why are you here? I want to make a deal with you, Harmony. A deal? With the power source to the hospital? Are you actually blackmailing me with the lives of the people here? Rukra, what happened to you? You used to be so... I have the power cord. Stop talking. God damn! Thank you. That's right. It is me. It's been a while. I'm not the person you knew anymore. I'm the leader of Perfection Cult now. As for why I'm here, I was trying to find you. You run the hospital here, right? You have access to all the patients in the building. We want to access the room containing the patient, Maud. That's my father's room, Rukra. There's no chance I'm letting you near him, and you know it. I thought you might say that. We actually have your father's best interests at heart, believe it or not. We know he's sick. We know what his condition is. Let us help you. We can both get what we want here. I'll put the power back on, like you want. Then we'll go to Mald's room on the top floor, and we can talk. Fine, whatever. Just hurry up. People's lives are at stake here. Very well. Plug that- Oh, so bright. Now, follow me. Dude, this is getting intense. What the hell is going on? You used to be so... different. They know each other from way back or something. What? Who is this mauled? More importantly, how does Harmony know a cult leader? No clue, but I'm planning on following them. Damo, you should come along. I'd love to have some support. So y'all ain't fighting anymore? <laughs> yeah, he's still, <laughs> he's still not talking to me after what I said. Freaking couples problems. I'm Someone out there ships you two. I can't blame him. What I said was awful. I just hope that he won't snap and betray us. Wait up, I'm coming. Yo, Damien should betray you. You already made him feel a certain way. He should just go far with those emotions and betray us all. Which sounds pretty weird. Why do I want him to betray us? Dude, we gotta find Mauld's room. Was there an... It was the weird old man that I thought was a granny. No, you're not the one. It must be. Remember that man I called a granny? I knew it! Are you crazy? I don't care how desperate I am. I'm not going to let you force inject some weird chemical into his bloodstream. It doesn't matter for friends. I'm not letting you touch him or any other patients here. You're a psychopath. A cultist. No way. Fine then. You can do it. Here's the vial. Dude, they're trying to inject them with some crap. They're going to turn them into a Delta Pokemon. Don't do it, Harmony. Analyze it. Do whatever you need to convince yourself it's safe. Fine. Maybe I will. <laughs> She's looking at it. Uh, what is this little uh, syringe? Do you know why we want to use your father, Harmony? Mauled was around during the original Delta incident in Hoenn. After Deoxys was defeated above Moss Deep City, people below started reporting strange fevers. Everything ended up being fine, but testing showed that everybody's DNA was slightly tainted. Not enough to be significant, but enough to be noticed if you look closely. My point is that Mauled's body may not react to viruses in the same way ours do. And there's one in particular that I find interesting. Hold on a minute. This is just Pokerus. This isn't dangerous. We've known about this for years. Exactly. The Pokerus is very unique as far as infections go. It helps the Pokemon rather than hindering it. It allows it to grow stronger. In the scientific world, we call this mutualism. What you're holding right now is a strain that specifically increases the HP stat. Now, even though the virus doesn't affect ordinary people, it might be able to help your father. Increasing his HP stat could heal him and even lengthen his lifespan. With some fine tuning, we might even discover a path to immortality. What do you say, Harmony? Dude, perfection cult. That would be their goals. All this perfection crap. I... This really is just the Pokerus virus in a tube. How do I know you're not lying? You don't. I owe you, Harmony. And at the moment, our interests happen to cross. You want your father healed, and this could be a breakthrough for our cult's research. It's merely a business transaction. Your father's life, our goals. Not only that, but if it works on him, it may work on you as well. They're from Hoenn, dude, and they've got this weird Pokemon mutation in their DNA. You're right about the DNA thing. He told me that a long time ago. I'm desperate enough to try it. But double-cross me, Rukra, and I swear. I'm glad to hear it. <laughs> Dude, Rukra's a G. Let's get this over with. Don't do it! Um, listen, I don't like needles. If you guys don't mind, <laughs> I think I'm gonna wait outside. Damien, you wuss! 
Shove a needle in him, Nora. Seriously? He's in the room with the cultists and he's scared of needles? Anyways. Okay, Dad. Hang in there. Three, two, one, and done. Was it a backstab or not? I don't think it... My dude woke up! Hello! You... Oh, you're awake! Are you okay? It was a backstab that Deox described. What? What's happening? You backstabbed her! Oh my Arceus, what the? Shh. We need to talk quietly. Be careful not to provoke him. Rukra, what on earth did you do? This wasn't supposed to happen. I'm not sure, but he looks a bit like Deoxys. I wonder if there's a connection. It would make sense. Deoxys is a virus known for its stats. Perhaps the Pokerus is an extension of this. You better fix him, Rukra, or I'll... I think he's been healed, at least. He should live longer too. The problem is that the virus may have impacted his mind somehow. It seems this experiment needs far more fine-tuning. But anyways, we need to stay quiet. As long as we're not loud, we can... Hey guys, so how did it go? Did the needle go in okay? Damien! You dumbass! He disappeared! You dumbass! And he took Damien? What an idiot! What have you done? This is your fault! This didn't go quite as planned, but what a breakthrough it's been. If he really is immortal now, then I'm sure we can find a way to use it without the drawbacks. Do you not care at all that someone just got kidnapped? What about my father? What did you do to him? Your father is fine. More than fine, in fact. He's the healthiest he's ever been. As for the boy, I'm sure he's fine. He may be infected, but the Pokerus helps, not hinders. My father would never do that. It's not really up to him at this point. And now, it's time for me to take my leave. I have an appointment to keep with the gym leader. I hope you appreciate this. Your father is immortal now, after all. Rukra! Freaking Giovanni's cousin! What a jerk! After all Sylvan and I did for him, you'd think he'd be a bit more appreciative. Damien. Listen, Nora, is it? We'll find your friend, I promise. Come with me. We'll try to figure out where Maul took him. I'd... I'd like that very much. Damo, you can help us if you want, but you might find it more useful to head to Kepler City. I'm worried that Rukra might have been talking about Anastasia, the leader there, when he said that he had an appointment. If you could warn her that she might be in danger, I'd appreciate it. The other thing is Mauled. If you guys see him again, you have to let me know. We need to figure out a way to reverse this. For my own sake, I have to believe that it's possible. Come on, Nora, follow me. Yo, what craziness just went down? J like, this isn't- this is crazy for a Pokemon game, dude. All this lore. Pokerus, which has always been in the game, is connected to Deoxys, which is overall connected to the Delta episode incident, where Brendan flies on top of Mega Rayquaza, beats Deoxys, but in the same way that Rayquaza spread Mega Evolution power everywhere, Deoxys spread its virusy DNA into everyone. And people got infected, people mutated because of it. Freaking Rukra came here with Pokerus in a little vial, and he gave it to someone infected by Deoxys' DNA mutation, so it triggered the full effect because Pokerus is Deoxys. And then the freaking kidnapped Damien, like a freaking half Deoxys, half human. Remember I said it would turn him into a Delta? I'm an idiot. I'm too stupid to figure out what this game really has to offer. Dude, that was crazy. That was so much. I thought it would just be the dark ride call and then we're gonna run into Persephone battle her and then she'll be like oh meet me in the freaking kitchen but it's freaking the perfection cult and I bet you he knew that he backstabbed her he knew there is something up with oh the first time we're ever trying this it's gonna be a miracle your father's gonna be immortal there's so much cool development going on here like you got this important harmony character and it's her father that's turning into a Deoxys now that is some craziness, dude. Next thing you're gonna tell me Deoxys is actually like a human. Like the original Deoxys that came down. There's also one more thing. Harmony mentioned that herself, Rukra, and Sylvan, who's the professor of this game, go way back. Which solves a lot of mysteries about this game. In the beginning of the game, the Perfection Cult leader actually walks into the professor's lab when we're getting our starter Pokemon and offers three Delta Pokemon. It's kind of weird because he's a cult leader. 
and the cult leaders they're not good like they're criminals if you talk to people they call them terrorists they really fear them and even audrey said she was like a murderer and crap so it was really odd that the professor had someone like him in his lab now we have answers to that there's some sort of history that we have yet to learn with harmony the professor of this game sylvan and rukra who used to be a good guy or something this is so cool dude there's a lot going on here Okay, so there's a few things we can do now. Let's talk to you first. Hello. Would you like to participate in a round of Poke Pawn? What's that? It's not what it sounds. It's a version of Gachapon, the vending machine for small capsules and prizes. Wow. This is what the dude was talking about when he said it was a freaking... <laughs> when he said it was chemtrails. I knew it. The granny finished cleaning up. Let's go in here. Route 10? I didn't want to go to the next area yet. All right, my dudes, let's quickly go into all these houses and see what everyone's up to. Hello. There used to be a restaurant here in Sonata, but the land got sold to build a new hospital. I got laid off, and the worst part about it is I can't really complain. If I whine about a hospital being built, I'm the bad guy. No, you're the bad girl. And you're also a bad girl. A Waterstone is able to evolve all sorts of Pokemon, such as Eevee and Poliwhirl. Thank you. I do have an Eevee, which I would <laughs> definitely like to evolve. It seems that every time I carry a Pokemon with quadruple weakness, every trainer has a move with that type. It is true, but hey, at least you get to listen to that freaking schling. Miss Harmony lives here when she's not working at her gym. I'm just the caretaker. I keep the place nice and tidy. Yo, Harmony, are you rich? Because if you are, then I have a couple questions. Oh, sports? Yeah, totally. I love watching the player get the a ball into the uh, receptacle. Go, our team. Get more points than the other team. The laziness of some people is astounding. Some Smeargle owners aren't even willing to go learn valuable moves like Spore and Ingrain. If you have one, I can save you some time by teaching it a thing or two. Never mind. Come back when you have a Smeargle. That's pretty useful. I mean, I know it is laziness, but you know how hard it is to get Smeargle to learn moves? The leader here, Harmony, is a real piece of work. I tried taking her on myself, but her mega meh. The point is, she's a real tough opponent. You'll have a doozy of a time against her. So you're freaking foreshadowing the mega mill tank. You look really familiar. I can't quite place it. I feel like I've seen you before, though. She knows me! Who am I? I lost my memories. Tell me who I am. How do people... Who am I? How can people recognize me? This is crazy. I grew up in Kanto and moved to Torn when I was younger. There's so much more to do here. But let me tell you, these cults are a lot scarier than Team Rocket. On the whole, it's a lot harder to decide which one I like more. I agree, dude. These cults are kind of up there with Team Rocket. I'm just because of the nostalgia glasses. I cannot stand how quiet this town is. Listen, I need a favor. Let me teach you a few loud moves. I'll teach you for free, but you gotta go out there and make some noise. You hear me? Hey, yeah. Uh, these suck. Let me teach Boom Burst. Don't teach to anyone. I'm not making any noise. Hey, there's a house down here. An Empoleon? Um, can I take it? It's cheating. <laughs> It's holding a choice scarf and participating in races. I'm here in Torn on a contract with Silphco. All I have to do is win races wearing their logo. You should give it a go. It's definitely easy money. So the dude did mention that people are sponsored in this region. That's pretty cool. There's an... What are all you kids doing here? What is this? Um, hello. Can you tell me? Are you planning on watching today's races? Yeah, let's watch the race. Lance, have you been to the race before? It's a race for Pokemon. Lily, I, I want to race. Oh my god, that rapid- Hello? I'm the sponsorship director. Can I get sponsored? I'm sorry. I want to win a sponsorship! The Sonata tickets. Alright. We're gonna give it a go. I'm gonna put- Oh, everybody can, huh? You know what? I'm gonna freaking put my burger on the line! Y'all think it's not fast? Just wait. Alright, icy path, because it's not fast. I'm gonna need that sliding bonus. I have to avoid hazards- I'm controlling- It's my- It's a Wobba Fett! Where do I go? Wait, y'all are in the way! Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I'm not supposed to use the speed up button. Help! Wobbuffet. Wobbuffet, go faster. Oh my goodness. Guys, they're all the way there. I'm not gonna win. You dumbass Aegis Slash. I freaking ran into it. What is going on? I. <laughs> it's really weird that I'm using a Wob. Is What was that? Did you see that, like, Magnazone looking thing? Also, this is a huge place. I gotta get in there. I gotta get in there somewhere. Okay, I can use the speed up button. I thought it would come down to the wire, and I have to... Don't show me the second auger's face! Look at that! A spectacular finish by Thamel's Junior Whopper! 49 seconds. Your Pokemon finished in first place. That's absolutely incredible. Your current sponsorship value is 100 bucks. For more information about sponsorships, please talk to my coworker. Coworker? Yeah, can I get sponsored? Please? 
Yeah. Cricket 2 knockoffs. <laughs> Y'all made actual companies to sponsor me? Dude, I'm not getting sponsored by the Cricket Tunes. Raichu? The Raichu's gonna beat me. I don't care. Hello, friends. I'm gonna use the speed up. That'll make it a lot easier. To watch, I mean. Oh my goodness. Look, I mean, oh my, that Raichu was fast. Run. Kids. Kids. Help. Help. Get away from me. No. They came down to the wire, but you didn't smell good enough. Oh, dude, this is like where we found our Delta muck. Oh my God, Suna. I'm sorry you died, but it was the help. Help. You freaking Roselia. Help me, please. Jump off. Oh my goodness. I'm going to finish in freaking 12th. Because this is Mario Kart. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I'm freaking third. Don't tell me I lost my sponsorship. I can get the Chespin Cheeps. Oh, it's freaking Rainbow Road. I should have known it was Rainbow Road. God. God. RC. What is this? Well, everyone stop. Why is it going so... What is this? What's going on? I'm... I, I've never been more confused in my life. What is the, What is even going on? Oh, this is not the end of the race. It's the freaking end of the race. Uh, fourth place. What's my sponsorship about? Please be freaking... I lost... That's it. That's it. We're done. We're done. I don't want to get sponsored. It was pretty stupid in the first place. Hey. Sorry, but I can't let you go back here. This is where our top racers groom and prep their Pokemon before races. Really? Oh my goodness. A freaking Scyther. A Rapidash. I can't see the rest of them. All right, my dudes. We're not ending off the episode with some races. We're going to actually do some crap. So let's go up here. Let's go into the next area. And let's actually make it towards the next town where we have to warn the gym leader. What was her name? Anastasia? Hello. Dude, I could to- Oh, God! A child trainer. Oh, how wonderful. I could totally find a Pokemon here. I gotta look up for hidden grottos. Gentleman Moim. With the chat on. Oh, hey, how about you use chatter? What are you doing? That's not gonna- Is that your only move? You're dead. Damn, that did a lot. I gotta look up for hidden grottos, and I also have to visit those other hidden grottos. You know what, man? A Jinx? Let me go into Rose. This is Rose's first time. Oh, my God. That Delta Icon. I haven't seen that since the days of Suna. In the days of my Delta Curlia. What was it, Quan? I'm sorry, Quan. Oh my god. Ow! No! You can't die yet! Why did I go into this? Dude, I'm an idiot. Don't do the... Fr Excuse you! Do not fart in my face like that again. You purple jinx! Yo, how rude. That's a physical attack. You know what? You know what? Screw your physical attacks. Hey! I said... What? What? I said to use charm! Oh my goodness. I'm scared, guys. I want... It's, it doesn't have any physical attacks. What, why did it have to... Why did it have to happen? Why? Stop it. Don't slam your body into me. Not after that wet fart. It was disgusting. Oh! Why did I use rollout? I'm tripping, guys. I'm not thinking smart. Beaten by a child. I love it! Dude, what the hell are you into? Then again, he, he's just an old man who's happy to see the next generation's prospering. There's a dude here too. Hello. I only train the best and strongest of Pokemon. That way I have no excuses if I lose. Oh, yeah. That's, that's definitely something. You do have the... I was going to say the dude looks like Silver. You have the attitude of Silver. It's King Arthur. The strongest of Pokemon, Drudagon. Hit me with the dragon move. Hit me. Ow! I wanted a dragon move. Now... Rock climb, huh? Rock climb, huh? I knew you would do Rough skin! Rough skin! Oh! Guys, what is wrong with me? I lost. I guess I really need it. Guys, what is wrong with me? What is... Can you tell me? This is not good. Look at my team. Mizu, you're literally dead. I'm on a budget, guys. I need to put him in the front. Look, we gotta look out for these... For these hidden grottos. Lady, lady... Lady, don't hurt, don't hurt me. The others hurt me. This battle was destined to happen. You can't avoid it or me. Okay. Destiny. Psychic Nana. Nana. Nana, be nice. Nana, be good. Nana, don't do that. Nana, this is gonna hurt. This really is gonna hurt. Don't you feel... Oh, a soul rock. Very nice, Nana. Nana, this is incredible. Nana, you couldn't even land the future site. Nana, you do not know destiny. I didn't think I would be destined to lose. That's very nice of you. That's very psychic of you. You know, everything's destiny. There's a freaking spot here. Dude, there's an item. 
I got it. Oh, you're trying to trick me. I love this. This is what I also I revived. Dude, I love when games just know how to freaking do the Pokemon elements right. Those hidden items. I'm out doing some field research for the leader, Anastasia. I'm just on edge because I almost died twice. Which means that... He just entered in like the champion. I had to pause for that. Scientist Faraday. You know, finding hidden items. You know in Final Fantasy where you could walk to the left of like the darkness and you could find a secret room? Stuff like that are game elements. A uh, Rotom? I love when freaking... Uh, you probably have Shadow Ball. I love when games do that. That's why I like hidden grottos. You're freaking weak. It, it's, it's just the kind of game element that I love. That's why I always try to take advantage of an opportunity of a hidden grotto appearing. I don't actually have something to fight a freaking Ampharos. Don't hurt me. You know what you need to do? Not hurt me. Oh, yeah. Do it up. Do it up one more time. <gasps> That's not scary. That was a very needed gasp. All right. Huh. I better do some more trials to make sure. Trials and tribulations. All of them. Alright, what are you looking at? Are you staring at a tree? Don't be an idiot. I was really expecting him to just turn around and yell at me. Because you know what he sees? A lot of lady bees. Oh, he sees me. Dragons are the strongest type of Pokemon. Prove me wrong. Mizu would like to speak to you. Oh my goodness, look at him. It's Dracula. Tyrion. Haxorus. Dude. Oh, Mizu, don't you talk... Oh my goodness, dude. I'm in trouble. Dude, I'm in trouble. No! Thunder Wave? Dude, I really needed that right now. Now I can probably kill you with the Hex, but I'm scared. Dude, I'm gonna heal myself up. Where's my Super Potions? I only have two. I really need this bit of HP. Okay, Dra oh my goodness. If it was Dragon Claw, it might kill- Who the hell gives Haxorus special moves? I think that's what they're trying to show. You catch the strongest Pokemon, you think you're the strongest trainer, but you give him the dumbest moves. It's like the whole point to it. No. No. You are wrong. No. No. All right. Now, am I... Don't get out of my road, Tom. I know it's a ghost. You didn't see, but it's not forgiven. I'm like, what the hell did I just find? Dude, I'm definitely finding my encounter here. Where am I going? I have repels. Where are they? Somebody point me. Point. Point to the screen. I'm looking. I have one repel. Where am I supposed to go? There's a diving spot. Is this for Sutopolis? The other round of Sutopolis? Is there a freaking hidden grotto or not? Dude, what the hell is this area? I'll surf for a bit more. No, because the repel is going to run out. But what? What is going on? No, I have to. I have to see what's here. The repel ran off. I'm going to find it. I'm going to find my encounter. This is it, guys. My encounter is right here. I didn't get my encounter. But where is the freaking hidden grotto? Kepler City. We made it, guys. This is the next town, Kepler City. Oh, dude, there's... Dude, there's going to be so much to do. Well, how do you even get across those things? And what is that over there? Armor dudes, I think that there's the gym. Already, we're going to deal with the next gym. It was just a tire. Armor dudes, this is where I'm going to have to end the episode. What do you want? The Anastasia secret lab? Dude, she has a secret lab? What if she's working with Rukra, the perfection cult leader? All right, guys, that's all time for this episode, guys. Be sure to smack the like button if you enjoyed the episode. If we can get this to 4,000 likes, my dudes, I will upload the next part right away. But in the next episode, guys, we're probably going into the gym. I don't know if we're going to take on it yet because some craziness usually intercepts it. But look at all the stuff there is to explore. As always, guys, I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.